Instagram just uh, our posts early, and I think that uh, got them kind of rattled. At the same time, could you guys ever relax against that group, even when you got up big? Oh, definitely not. Uh, we knew they were a good team. I mean, they went into Iowa and won by 17 points, I think. So we knew they were a good team, and they weren't going to back down. And I think they showed uh, kind of what they're made of in the second half. But that result that I would do for you, Antoine, as far as maybe respecting these guys coming in here? Uh, watch it a lot. I uh, didn't really expect them to do that to Iowa. Uh, like I said, they're a really good basketball team. They have a really good young point guard. Uh, they have guys that can score. And their offensive rebounds. It's just crazy. They crash the boards uh, better than I've seen in a long time. So obviously we had respect, and I think uh, that's why we kind of came out and did what we did. Uh, knowing that if you came out sluggish, you could have resulted in something else. Both of you mentioned the defensive end of the court. Was that a point of emphasis afterwards? Uh, I think it's always a point of emphasis for us. Uh, we get out and deny, we pressure, that's part of uh, what we are. And uh, towards the second half, at the end of the first half, we uh, got away from that. I guess both of you guys, can you talk about, you both have <coughs> but obviously you're facing a pretty challenging week this week, going to San Diego and then playing Nebraska here. Talk a little bit about that. Uh, it's going to be an awesome week. Uh, I think it all starts with these uh, four practices we have here uh, going into San Diego. Uh, uh, they just beat the number 20th team in the nation on the road, so we know they're, uh, they got a really good group. And, uh, Coach Fisher does a really good job with them. And obviously, Nebraska is looking a lot better this year with the transfer from LSU. And it should be a challenging week, but uh, that's what we're up for. I think it's just going to be fun. I think it's what uh, we all look forward to good players playing other good players. It's just you know, the pride and glory of basketball. You're going to play other good teams, get to go on the road, and then come back home and play another good team. So I think we're up for it. And we just got to get prepared for these, these four days we have. You guys had to put one one reason why you're five and zero at this point. What would it be? Uh, unselfishness. I think that explains it best. Uh, guys like Antoine, Grant Gibbs have been uh, phenomenal sharing the ball. Uh, Sixteen assists between the two of them tonight. I think uh, we understand if we want to win, that's, that's what we're going to do. I'd say probably our camaraderie as a team. Uh, we get just as excited for anyone scoring good pass or anything, we just think we play for each other, uh, and it's, it's definitely showing. You guys learn about your ability to play, you obviously had some guys in foul trouble tonight, your ability to play in that kind of scenario, learn anything tonight? Yeah, I mean, uh, once Greg went to the bench, uh, we had to count on Will and Ethan a little more, and uh, I think it shows a lot uh, about our depth, uh, they came in and played well for us, and uh, we got to I like I Doug said, we do have a lot of depth, but at the same time, we don't need to commit dumb fouls. I think we had a couple of us as a team committed just some dumb fouls, putting them on the line. Uh, but if we can get rid of that and actually use our fouls wisely, I think 